The Maritime Aquarium in Norwalk has a new face on its team. Actually, we shouldn't in this case pick them up out of the water. We want them to stay in their environment so that they're um, best protected as possible. Brian Davis officially took his position earlier this week as the aquarium's new president and CEO, succeeding Jennifer Herring, who has been the aquarium's president since 2004. I was excited from day one about this opportunity. Look at that. You follow his lead, you're going to be fantastic. There is a, a character in this community that is just fantastic. It's really phenomenal. Um, and the support that they've shown so far, I've gotten tons of emails. Uh, lots of individual welcomes, and it just feels great to be a part of this community. Davis is a native of New Jersey and was the former vice president of education and training at the Georgia Aquarium in Atlanta. He says he's looking forward to reaching out and working more with the community of Norwalk. What I want to do is really spend some time doing sort of the listening tour. And the listening tour, a big part of that is understanding the operations within the organization and really establishing the foundation with the staff that I'll be working with and the volunteers, and then heading out into the community and really finding out what the community would like to see um, in this awesome facility that they've actually rallied around and supported for quite a bit of time. The Maritime Aquarium is one of the largest attractions in Connecticut, bringing hundreds of thousands of visitors and students to the South Norwalk area since its opening in 1988. I think the biggest thing that we want to do is continuing to strategize with the community, making sure that we work collaboratively as from a community standpoint to make sure that our guests that are visiting from out of town really have a well-rounded, robust experience here in Norwalk. In Norwalk, I'm Priscilla Lombardi for It's Relevant News.